What is up guys, this is Moist here from Sectionster once again and unfortunately we often get some news about people not being happy with the options the product information bar from Shopify brings. So we came up with this solution and made this section right here. It's a product information badge or icon section, whatever you want to name it. You can customize it to your likings, change the icon color, the size, whatever you prefer, and of course the text and give the customers a nice little overview about what benefits they're gonna get from getting your product. So let's get right into it and I'll show you how you can install it for your very own store. The first thing I did for this is that I headed on over to the Shopify app store where I did get the section store app completely for free. And after successfully downloading the app, just head on over to the Shopify admin area where you can open up the app in the left bottom corner right here and then go and explore sections and either with the help of the search bar or just this one right here find the trust badges free section i'm just going to click on it you can get this one for a one-time charge of nine dollars but if you look at it like that it's definitely going to increase the conversion rate of your products because it will intentionally direct the attention of your customers to this block right here and hopefully in the long term they will be more likely to buy the product so i think nine dollars once isn't too bad for it and like i said already you can customize it to your likings could also look something like this of course this is a bit more customized and will take up some time but i'm showing you how you can get a little version or like a simple version of it in no time okay let's head back to the my sections area of the app where you are able to find all the sections you already own and I'm gonna click on this one right here, add it to the theme I'm using. In my case, it's the Dawn Live theme, but it does work on every theme, so don't worry about that. And also a nice benefit of the app is that even after installing sections, you can still delete the app and remain with the section itself. So it's not gonna slowly store down. It's simply just copy pasting the code into the backend of your Shopify page. So yeah, that much to that. Then simply just open up the theme editor of your choice. And here I have it already. That is the one you saw in the beginning of the video. I'm just gonna get rid of this, save it up so you can see how it works completely from scratch. Click on it, type in trust batch. Trust batch free, that's the one we are looking for. Save it up, always make sure to save it up so you don't run into errors or it won't show up the way it's supposed to be. I'm just gonna drag it up and here you can see it. And the first thing I would like to do is actually show you that it can be changed, like the position of it. So if I would want to have it below the buy buttons, I'll simply just save it up and we can see the magic of the sectioner. So here it's going to be below the buy buttons. I'm actually going to leave it here. We can switch the item gap right here. Everything is customizable. The icon size is something we can change as well. Of course, the whole thing is fully responsive. So if I go to mobile, you're going to see this is working as well. We made sure of that so you don't have to worry about it anymore. And now I'm going to scroll down a bit more, change the icon color to green because I do think this is looking nicer and I do not want a border. So I'm just gonna click on the border right here and select this. Now it's gonna be transparent and after saving up, it's not gonna show up anymore. And the text color, I would actually like to be in that green and instead of that color, I wanna have the icons in orange. So this is gonna pop out a bit more and after saving up, it is looking like this already. This is looking pretty good. We can also give it a little section background if we would want to. In this case, I'm gonna make it a bit gray. Save it up so just you can see it is actually working. Here we have it. And what would make sense, of course, is adding some padding to the whole thing. So it has a bit of space to breathe. Also padding to top, padding to the bottom. And now we have something like this. And this is already looking quite nice, of course. You can do a lot more customization to that whole thing. Pick your own icons and and you're pretty much guaranteed to make it look nice. Let's have a final look at it in the live version. Give this one a little review, another re reload. And here you can see what we did. I hope you guys found that useful. If you did, always feel free to leave a like and a follow. And with that being said, have a good one and peace out.